Yo guys, twice. Uh, I believe this is the Story Begins EP. Let me actually check Spotify real quick. I just had it up. Um, we already did like ooh ah ooh ooh ah ooh ah ah. Which one was it? It was one of those. It was one of those. I don't know. I haven't heard the song again since. So I don't remember. Spotify's opening now, so we can confirm both of these things. Wait, it's being slow for some reason. Give it a second. It's open. Now I can go to the search bar. Go to twice, because I was just there. Go to discography. Go to singles and EPs. And go all the way down. The story begins EP, like ooh ah. So I already did like ooh ah. If you want to check out my reaction to that music video, definitely go check it out. If not, you are going to be doing the rest of the EP here. Still five songs, still a pretty sizable amount. So let's get right into it. The first, or technically second track, because Like Ooh Ah is the opening uh, piece, we got Do It Again, which, according to Spotify stats, also does pretty well. Uh, this and Like a Fool probably did the best outside of Like Ooh Ah, because it didn't have a music video, clearly. Um, well, the other three are a little bit more under the radar. Um, for better or worse, we will find out. Let's check out Do It Again. I'm excited to see uh, why this one stands out. That intro. Ah, I like that. You know what? For the vibe they're going for, not bad so far. Let me reset my earbuds on my headphones though, real quick, because like that last sentence there did 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 do. I don't know if y'all have seen my videos before, but every now and then my headphones want to trip the fuck out and make it sound choppy and weird. So I'm going to rewind a little bit. But so far, they are kind of nailing this uh, this sound so far. And this is a good sound for a girl group. I love songs like this. Well, mostly older ones, but 2015, while yes, a little bit late to the party, can still bring something to the table. Let's get it. But I might like this one more than like Ooh Ah. This is hard. Yeah, I fuck with this one, guys. I'm already gonna say this is my favorite off the album so far, or the EP so far. They come with that energy. That really in your face energy, bro. And now they're talking shit about me. I didn't even do nothing. <laughs> so it's a, it's, a, it's a venting frustration track from what I'm gathering. back into that oopsies they're hitting everything so like on the beat rhythmically beautifully oh my god I got to. Did I get it right? <laughs> Solid rap verse two. Oh. Oh. Okay, Mo Momo. Yeah. This is a fucking banger. I don't care what nobody says. And my back is still itching, even though it's like four fucking times.
Dude. Oh, it's not even over. Dude, okay. Okay, starting strong. I do like that more than like ooh ah, which, which probably is going to get me some shit. Um, and I still do need to be re listening to like ooh ah, because I said I would. Or even if I didn't, I still feel like I need to. Um, not going to be doing that here, although I probably should, but I'm kind of lazy. Um, and I would rather do it off the video. <laughs> uh, but if you guys remind me in the comments, I will definitely let you guys know my updated thoughts on the song, uh, as always. And uh, yeah, let, let's get it. Next, we got Going Crazy. Um, if you can see me keep checking my phone, it's because I'm awaiting a, a very important Fortnite invite. Moment that happens, I'm dipping. But I'll obviously finish the video at a later time. But if, it's an important it's an important Fortnite gaming uh, <laughs> moment. Uh, but yeah, let's go going crazy. Um, going crazy didn't do too bad either. 7 million listens. I think it's just a case of like... Like Ooh Ah is obviously going to have the most good of the music video and it's the first track. But dude, again, is like if you're listening to the EP when it first came out, it's the first track. So of course it'd have a lot of listens. I'm honestly more interested in Like a Fool in terms of its listens because it's the last track. Which normally doesn't have the most listens unless it has some sort of significance that I don't know about. Um, it's always the middle tracks that can be either very overrated or underrated or they're just filler. And I'm excited to see. Let's Let's get it with Going Crazy. Got my attention. Now, what will you do with it? Okay, so that's strong. Nice. This is this is pretty fire too. Ooh. That transition was hard too. Boo. The melody or the the I guess you could say melody or the rhythm they're they're singing at in, in the verses is also pretty like not catching the way that the hook is but catching the way that it like brings you along in the journey makes you want to keep listening Pleasantly surprised with the ZP so far. You know what? They handle the rap verse to, uh, well as well. Because ah, they blended it into the current vibe with that like second part where it was like a little bit of a back and forth. Uh, sometimes, it, 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 you know, kind of like I think I said this about like ooh ah, but sometimes it's like hard to manage um, as a listener. But here, I think it blends well. Although, like I said, I do need to do the like ooh ah re listen. I might just do it and then add it to the end of this video. I won't lie because I feel bad. I totally fucking forgot. <laughs> All 
Oh, what you be, man? Hey! Damn, bro. Two fucking bangers in a row. Let's see. Can truth carry it along? A very important question. Once again, going to be checking for that Fortnite invite. Don't think he wants to play anymore. Unfortunate. Let's go. Truth. Oh boy, the picture is decreasing in quality every time I look at it. Look at that. <laughs> that is, that is uh, very worrying. Especially since it says 1080. Even at 1080, this shit is fucking pixelated. Eh, it was 2015. I'll give them a break. In 2015, I was in middle school, bro. I think. Yeah, it's definitely middle school because the XXL Freshman Cypher was 2016. And I was in middle school for that. Very distracting font. I'm going. I'm going to have to re-listen re to that. What the fuck just happened? That's kind of cool. Ooh. Oh no! This just sounds like the OG Fortnite waiting screen. The instrumental. But it kinda hits, man. Fuck, three in a row? No! I'm not supposed to be this nice. Oh my goodness. A lot of the songs, at least on this uh, EP, I don't know if this stays true for all their tracks, but a lot of them are very like to the hypothetical romance or whatever. Mm. <laughs> Which obviously isn't anything out of the norm for like a girl group. It's just interesting. Um, not necessarily. I guess a lot of K-pop girl groups that I've seen have done it too. But I've also seen a few where it's like the fans really pride themselves in uh, how they aren't like other girls and do this. It's funny because I just reacted to Nmix, and this is what I said on that video. I was like, every time I react to a new group. I always get the same comment. Oh, this group isn't like the other groups. Whether it's a boy group or a girl group for K-pop. It's always like, this group, not like the other ones. They make shit so different than everyone. And then on that video, I got the same exact type of comment. It was like, they are raising the vocal standard for this gen. They are not like the other groups. Do not lump them with, <laughs> with what came before it. I was like, god damn, bro. You're proving my point. <laughs> like, I like a lot of groups. I like ATs a lot. I'm not that much of a dick writer, though. I'm sorry. But I also don't watch reaction videos, so. I got time. I don't watch shit. I don't my time making videos. But damn, so far this EP, things are looking very bright, bro. I'm extremely impressed for a debut EP to do this year. Especially for the time it came out, because obviously, if something comes out now, it's gonna s sound probably a bit more polished. Um, especially with more money behind it, more you know, K-pop's more. Not to say that in 2015, K-pop wasn't already huge. I honestly don't know. I'm assuming probably to an extent for sure. Um, but especially now, I feel like there's probably a lot less hesitance to put money into things like this uh, for new groups. So for 2015 as well, shit. Uh, not like I'm gonna be babying them or pitying them being like, oh my god, they probably had no resources. No, they definitely did, but still 
Very good. Very good. I like the the hard instrumental with the slow vocals. Like they can work so well. I'm not saying slow vocals, but like you know the slower rather than some of the other songs. I don't know. I guess it is slow vocals. Slow melody. God damn it. This is probably my favorite part of the song. This is a fire pit, by the way. God damn. Dude. Dude. Like. Shout out to Twice, man. So impressive, bro. This consistency. Okay, next we got Candy Boy. What the fuck kind of name is Candy Boy? Yeah, whatever. Let's get it. <laughs> Oh boy. This is what we're doing. Okay, this one seems to have a bit of a different topic than the other two. Or three. I'm never done. I've only I've done three. Oh my goodness. This is going by so fast. It's going by too fast. Oh, never mind. I love everything I see about you. Fuck, never mind. I thought it was gonna be a different type of song. <laughs> We're going to see you shit. I really like the hook. That's, that's strong. Cook definitely makes this one, but it's okay. Yeah, this is another win. Damn, bro. It's a cool outro, too. A little fade out. That's nice. Only one more, man. One more. Like a fool. We already have made it. It has only been 20 minutes. Okay, for some reason, it doesn't feel like it's been 20 minutes. 20 minutes sounds long. One last track, Like a Fool. Like I said, I'm interested in this one because it seems like it's done pretty well.
11 million views bro i mean listens that's more listens than i have views on all my channels combined uh... Ooh, is this gonna be a sentimental outro like i'll see you next time oh please Not what I was expecting, but sounds pretty cool. Maybe it's the high register that I wasn't expecting. I was expecting to be lower for some reason, which is stupid of me. Another W on the fucking board for twice. Okay, this, this is crazy, man. I didn't expect every song to be good, to be or, or at least like great. Because goods, I like good songs, but I like great songs even more. Because honestly, I'd rather listen to a great song than a good song. I don't know if that makes sense. Because there'll be songs that people like, and I think they're pretty good too. But then there's songs that I like even more. And obviously, I'm gonna listen to the songs that I think are great more than the songs that are good. So it's like, oh, Eddie, you said the song is good. Why don't you listen to it that much? Well, because I'd rather listen to songs that are great. I'm sorry. Dude, what the fuck did I just experience? <laughs> this beat is fucking fire, too. Dude, what the fuck? Shout out to Twice, man. Shout out to Twice. Shout out to Twice. I'm gonna add my little, I guess, realist and I like ooh ah here. And if I don't, it's gonna be in the comments. So, uh, bye. But if not, then see you in a second. Peace. Y'all, I might have been a little bit too mean to like ooh ah, because I'm recording this after recording my reaction to their second EP. <laughs> so, even in that video, you might see me dog on it a little bit, but well, I still kind of hold the same opinions on the, the more, I don't know if I call them rappy parts, but they're closer to rap than they are the normal singing that they do. It's definitely not my favorite from Twice, especially on the second EP. They had some really good moments of that, but the hook has so much heart. It's nice. It's really nice. So I might have been a bit too mean to like, ooh, ah, B, 
Because the hook is so goddamn good that it makes me forget anything that I might not like about the song. Low key. So yeah, just wanted to include that. And uh, anything you hear me say in the next reactions, up until the the second EP, because even the second EP I was talking about it, it all predates this. So technically you're seeing the future. Ooh.